Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gigi and this is Gigi's Planner Room and today I'm gonna have for you guys a short video. I already did the setup for the Butterflies and Blooms planners and the notebook and the reason why I already did the setup is because I have been using it um, every single day. I use it for my daily to-dos. So this planner right here is a 12 month planner. Like I mentioned, it's a Butterfly and Blooms Classic Happy Planner, horizontal. And I have it together, Frank and Planned, with the Butterfly and Blooms uh, notebook. And it has the 60 um, dotted line pages, which I'm going to be showing you soon. And this one, I am using it on a daily basis, like I mentioned. And I use it for business, personal, home, family, study, faith, anything that I need to do. Anything that I need to get done. Anything that I have already done. I try to write it in here. Um, just so I can keep track of things of when it was done and when I did it or you know things like that um, and to stay together with this butterfly and blooms this glue right here this is actually a horizontal planner but I am already using it it doesn't start until January of 2023 so this is the beginning of it, but I decided to add from planners that I stopped using um, October, November, and December. So I can start using it now. So this is what I'm using for October, and this is what I'm using for November and the month of December. I got this from a planner that I stopped using a few months ago. Um, and this is where I mark where I am today. So today is Tuesday. So... As I'm going on every single day, that's when I decide to write whatever I'm going to do or whatever I did already on that day, just to keep track of things. So it's not it's not a planning ahead planner. It's just a day by day things that I got to get done. Um, I am using this planner. This divider that I'm using is from a home body a divider and I have it facing this way because I put it right um, above my keyboard so to see what page i'm on i just look for this mark right here i don't know if you guys can actually see it but it's right here and i just open it in there so sometimes i keep it open and what i do i just flip the page and i just leave it like this on my desk and like that i'm able to see the entire week um or the first three days of the month of the week and then the last four I don't usually do anything on Saturday because since I use it mostly for things for work, to keep track of things for, for work, then I just use Monday through Friday. And then I decided this is a transformer planner. I'm using copper, I think this is copper, color metal disc from the Happy Planner. And then I decided to use this as a transformer planner because I did add the notes from the same collection, Butterflies and Blooms, and this is the notebook. So when I go like this, this is the notebook. I have the three dividers right here. This one has the dotted lined um, paper, if you can appreciate that. And then I keep some notes in here of things that I need to get done, things that I have to do, depending on what it is. And then Whenever I don't need it, I actually do throw it away. I don't keep it in here because if I don't need it anymore, I don't, there's no need for me to keep it for any future nothing. So I just get rid of it. So that's what I'm, I'm using for my daily to-dos, whether it's work, personal, home, meals, it doesn't matter. I just try to keep track of things in here. Um, now I'm using it as a vertical, but let's see how it works when I have to change it to the horizontal one because that's actually what is supposed to be the horizontal planner. And I decided to use that as that, this one as that, because it was an extra that I bought because I do love butterflies. I said, let me buy it. I'm sure I can use it for something. So I decided to use it on a daily basis for um, my to-do list. I wanna show you how I am using the mini planner because as you saw in my lineup, um, for 2023, I do have the mini planner for the same collection. So I have the mini right here. This is a Motarm cover and this is a Dusty Rose color. I love this Motarm. This is so pretty. I love taking this in my purse. I love taking it to go. I sometimes don't even put it in my purse. I just take it in my hand and I have it in the car for anything that I need to do on the go. 
I write it in here or I check mark everything in here. Sometimes when I have to go, let's say to um, grocery shop, um, like BJ Sam's Club, um, I take this and I have my notes in here. I'm sorry if I'm moving the camera. But right now, um, I think I show you guys how I'm using it. But this is the one that I'm currently using, which is the 2022 planner. This cover I got from Live Love Push. This was a mistake order and I decided to just keep it because I was the one that made the mistake. But I like it because it's covering my uh, planner cover, which I really love this butterfly. So I want to keep using this for future um, planners if possible. I have the pink metal disc from the Happy Planner. Let me see if I can give you a close up on them. I think I have shown them before. But if you're new, if you haven't seen my videos, I'll show you right now. This uh, Moterm has a pocket here. That's why you see that's opening. But I don't want to talk about the Moterm. I want to talk about my setup. If you do want to see my unboxing of the Moterm, I'll try to leave it um, on the description below. Leave the link in there for that video. So, like I was saying, this is the 2022 mini planner that I'm using right now. I have it... I want to say Franken Plan Transformer Planner together with the 2023 because when you open it, it's the 2022. But if you see this tab right here, this is already the 2023. So I do have the front cover for the 22, but I do not have the back cover for the 22. I decided to just use the front cover for the 23 and that's how I'm dividing it. So here I have Shop Me Notes, regular notes, personal notes, notes from my company. And then here I removed the month of October because we are already in the month of November. Like that I have more space in here. It's more flexible and it's not so thick when I close it. So right now we are in the month of November and sometimes I decorate it, sometimes I don't. These are some of the things that I need to do or things I need to get done in the month of November. So as you can see, I don't decorate my monthly and I have been working on decorating my weekly. Just something really quick. I don't think I post pictures anywhere. I don't remember if I do. I try to post pictures, but sometimes I forget, guys. And I would like to share all my pictures, but I forget because there's so many social medias. But I try to mainly do it on my Instagram. So if you are not following me on my Instagram, follow me there because I post most of my pictures there. I also have a Facebook page. Um, where I post pictures and I also have a Facebook uh, where you can follow me like my page on Facebook They're all with the same name Gigi's Planner Room So you can just search for my name and all of those things are gonna come up so This is this week right now Today's Tuesday today is the 8th um, So I haven't done anything for the 14th and then I have November and December for 2022 here and then this is it for my 2022 planner, which I am gonna miss this cover, but I'm hoping to be able to use it in the future so I can keep using it um, with my uh, Moterm because I think pink, the different pinks, they look really nice together. So unless Happy Planner comes up with something else that's pink, this is gonna be the beginning part of my covers. This is the 2022, I'm sorry, the 2023 planner that I'm going to be using. It's a mini happy planner. It's the same thing as my notebook as you can see here. When I did the um, lineup I was able to show you guys that they're all the same. It's just a mini size. So there are some stuff that are different like you can see here. Some things that are different is not exactly the same but for most, for the most part they're the same. So here I have from January of 2023 all the way to December of 2023 and I added from the same collection butterflies and blooms um, a small envelope plastic envelope here from the happy planner and then the back cover of the happy planner and then I'm using the other cover from live love push just to hold it in place in here in my motor. But that's what I'm using for 2023 this butterfly and blooms collection. Okay, there it is. And that's how I have my mini on-the-go planner. I have it here with a, a Tombow pen and marker, I should say, and my regular pen, which I took it out. 
so there you go that's how i have my mini butterfly emblems on the go and my classic size butterfly emblems planner with my classic size butterfly emblems notebook this accessory pack that i bought also together from the same collection butterflies and bloom um i have some sheets i have this folder in here that for now i don't need it so i keep it in here i have some extra sheets in here for um whatever notes this i'm keeping it here because it has butterflies this i bought it at hobby lobby these are the extra sheets from the notebook but because it was getting too thick, of course, I only put a few in there, whatever I needed at the time. Um, this right here are just goals to set up for 2024 or your next year because it's not dated. And then these sheets right here, I really like a lot, but I haven't used them yet because I've been so extra busy with things at work and at home for the past few weeks that I haven't had a chance to do anything with planner related um, but I do like to use I would like to use these sheets for a daily to do's also um, because I have your priorities right here and then any list that I need to do um, throughout the day I can just add it in there or the week and make, just make sure that they get done and and mark them right now I'm not using them this is the front of it and this is the back of it but right now I don't see a use for it because of how I'm using the planner so I'm just keeping them here for now just so they don't get messed up because there's no need for me to write anything double so that's how I have those for now okay I think that's gonna get messed up if I put it there so let's put them in here so it's a little bit more organized and they don't fall apart so these are my butterfly and blooms um, accessory pack and then I have the planner and the notebook and that's how I'm using this setup for this collection this is all I had to show you guys for this collection and this setup um, because I already had it done I didn't have to do nothing here with you guys like I mentioned at the beginning this was gonna be a short video so here it is a short video of how I'm using my butterflies and blooms and the setup that I'm using on a daily basis for anything that I personally need to do so I hope you guys liked the video if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up I want to thank you guys for being here and watching my videos all the way to the end i really appreciate that and i really appreciate all the views and the likes that you guys have given me i appreciate the support i love how the channel has been growing that means the information i'm providing is good for you and you like it and you're taking advantage of it and that makes me really happy anything that i can do to help you better yourself let me know i would love to do it i would love to help you out just like i have other people that help me out on a daily basis to get things done the way that i would like for them to be done so no more talking i'll see you guys on my next video hasta pronto adios